Okay, everyone, welcome back to the latest Versus series. This is going to feature, I will cover the deck uh, after the episode with my friend here. It's my Wild Druid, J Druid deck, and you see the list there, but I'll go over it in detail after I'm done. Uh, I played on the ladder, and I'm 3 and O. Oh, it, oh, man, he's using Reno. Oh, man. Anyways, uh, let's go over this real quick. Okay, we're obviously going to keep Innervate. Get rid of Raven Idol. Perfect Jade Idol. Turn one's excellent. That's okay. We could put that out on turn three. Oh, Nourish is okay. Okay. Always the first one. Always uh, summon. You never cycle. It ruins your card drawing. You don't need that until late game anyways. Uh, yeah, I've done really well. And I'll tell you one thing. Sludge Belcher's the star. He's just so awesome and uh, to have. It slows down the game. It gives me a lot of tempo i don't know if he's gonna be able to deal with fandra i'm really tempted on to uh putting him out there you know what let's try it what's the worst that can happen right he's not gonna be able to have um any hard removal anytime soon he wait a minute he could have he doesn't have the he has a coin i think right so that means he could uh no it still won't be enough but let's see what he has Oh, okay. Oh, he's zoo. I thought he was going to be, um... I thought he was going to be, uh... I'm uh, getting ramp, which is good. If he survives, next turn is going to be sweetest. Uh, next turn will be sweet as hell, but we'll, we'll see. I used it... Okay, that might not be enough. It might, might be, it might be. Depends if he gets... Oh, yeah, he's lucky. All right, well played. All right. So, we have... Ooh, we have swipes. We actually could, uh... Clear his board here, right? Here, hold on. We have swipe, or we could draw a card. Uh, yeah, we kind of have to clear his board here. Let's do that. Um, what I was gonna say, we're just gonna float up. We're gonna float him on. We're gonna lose a minion though. Is there any better way to deal? I mean, I could technically hero power into him, get rid of that, and deal with it next turn. But I'm not gonna be able to play this. I need a. I need to. Uh, oh no, don't worry. We we gotta deal with this. It's just too. Uh, I lose my minion no matter what. So let's take out the juggler. In the next turn, we'll, we'll, we'll try to recover. We, we can't leave uh, both those minions on. They're must kills. I was trying to hopefully we were able to handle it a different way, but we... Oh, yeah. So this is going to be very bad. Wild against this. Okay, so we're going to stay on curve. We're pretty doing pretty decent. Um, we got good card draw next turn. We had pretty decent ramp. Uh, but the problem is... What is he going to pull right now? Marganus? Oh, jeez. <laughs> We're going to have to deal with it. That's just so bad. Do we have any kind of... We could try that. Okay, so that's... um Enough to deal with him, right? we got to deal with it. We lose our board. Um, you know, let's get the jades going. Uh, he's not. He's kind of low on cards, but as always, they draw a lot of stuff. In game boss has to be dealt with. Oh, Ruby and Egg. I, I hate those. All right. So next turn, let's see what we get. Um, Raven Isle is pretty good. Let's get a minion. I rather prefer a minion than a. Oh, this. That's excellent. Uh, let's see what we're gonna. D you know what? We should really deal with that though. Um. We'll have to use a minion. Actually, let's uh, let's uh, use a minion first to see what we get. Uh, so that way he trades in into it. He's gonna die. Matter of fact, let's see. We get a spell. Ooh, of all these, I would say that's the best. Gives ramp. Okay, we have to obviously. I'm going to lose my 5-2, um, which sucks, but I can't leave that 5-3 on board. Uh, he'll obviously lose, but next turn we get a 6-6 six, six at least. 
This is gonna be a good battle, guys. Really good battle. Oh, okay, good. He doesn't have the Defender of Argus. We took care of Malganus. So that's probably the most uh, difficult um, minion we're gonna deal with. Is he gonna have an activator for that? Yeah, he does. So we're way behind yet again, but we're gonna hopefully get some tempo going here. And Zoo is just a horrible counter. So let's do this. Yeah, I'm doing pretty decent against a uh, under. I'm um, very much an underdog, but um, I haven't even got my sludge belchers. I'm really surprised how well this deck's been doing on the wild ladder. I uh, really enjoy it. I really enjoy. It. I know there's a lot of hatred, a lot of bickering about this deck, but I love it. It's it's really cool. All right, sludge belcher is well. First, before we put him down, let's see what else we get. I'm most likely gonna go down. Oh, that's actually really good. That's good. That's good. Okay, so let's see what we're going to do. Where are we going to put him down? We already did the other one. I'm. Well, let, let's focus on this first. Let's get rid of that, obviously. Uh, we could actually get rid of that with the hero power of that, but I don't think that's the best. Um, it might be so I could keep these guys to deal with this. Uh, let's see. Um... No, let's let, let's deal with that. All right, so no, do, mm, that I'm not too concerned about. Cause this you have to shuffle because it's uh my second copy. All right, so let's kill him. He's the most annoying. And then we have the sludge belcher uh, next turn. He's gonna obviously get rid of the six two, but he. Might not be able to deal with a 7-5. Oh, okay, so he can. Okay, so he, he could deal with almost both of them. All right. All right, so we're still in it. Sludge Belcher, like I said, is pretty damn awesome. I don't know if he has silence, but this. Oh, hold on. Border. Got to get rid of that. It's just too powerful. Yeah. I'm out of cards, but I got my auctioneer hopefully coming up. But a sludge belcher is just just such a great tool against uh, aggro. And uh, zoo, you know, zoo's unfavorable for druid. So <laughs> I don't know if he's giving up or not, but it's it, it's just a lot of fun. Yeah, but anyways, I'm gonna make a real video on the ladder with this. I've gotten I'm three and zero so far. Famous last words, right? But uh, we have to trade, even though he's, uh, oh, oh, I hope I have my second swipe, oh, wow. All right, this is good, because we uh, might get swipe. I hope I get my auctioneer, but swipe would be perfect. Ooh, that's actually just as good. Oh, hold on, order. Uh, I know I would love to go to face, but... You cannot leave a board up uh, for um, for Zoo. I mean, it's going to be tough for him to make a comeback from this. Uh, now I'm going to start putting a lot of pressure over it. We'll see. So what I'm talking about? You cannot leave Zoo unchecked. I'm going to have to trade into that. And it's just the long game is my in my favor. And I'm a control player, so I always trade. I, I understand. Some people would probably go face, but I don't like it because I don't know how many times it has gone back. It's backfired big time for me. All right, so he's going to get rid of that. We're obviously going to trade this in. It's going to leave one HP, but ooh, I kind of feel bad for him. Yeah, he could mortal coil all of these. I don't know if they have that though. Played. <laughs> oh, Doctor Spectacular. There was a time where this guy just seemed so powerful, right? And I don't have mulch, but uh, 
no bad manners here, so we're gonna let, let let's just do draw card draw. Just to rub it in. Ooh, swipe finally. Ooh. <laughs> Anyways, guys, let's go over the deck. That was a lot of fun. Okay, what a epic showdown. And sorry for the delay between the time to take a small break. And then we had a rematch, and I won that one. But that, he got much, much closer. He got me down to 6 HP, and uh, the Sludge Belchers came in to play. I should have recorded that one, but... I didn't. But anyways, let's go over the deck list. So it's interesting that I was able to take uh, on a zoo deck, uh, which uh, is very unfavorable for Druid, as we all know. Anyways, two Innervates, two Wild. Sorry, sorry. Two Innervates, two Jade Idols, two Living Roots, two Raven Idols, two Wild Grows, two Rasps, Bronze, Bron, Bronze Beard. Uh, because I think the wild ladder is a little bit slower than standard, even though you do have a lot of aggro, though, sometimes. Two Jade Blossoms, uh, Fandral, two Jade Spirits, two Swipes, two Azure Drakes, two Nurse, two Sludge Belsters. They're the VIP of this deck, I think, them. And, the, of course, the Jade Behemoth down at the bottom. Then Ari Black Paw, Lover, the Gadget Zan Auctioneer. You need him. I feel one's enough, even though there's sometimes, I think even during this episode here, that uh, I was kind of a little low on cards. But I think one's enough. I think two's way too greedy. Uh, and the J. Blim is down below, and I just crafted the golden version of him. And I plan on crafting the golden versions of the spirits very soon. And a step closer towards my ultimate goal. So I will do ladder games um, with this deck. Uh, so far, I'm 3-0, and so it's pretty good. No, that's not counting the one tonight against my friend. I don't count the verses because they're just for fun. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoy this. And then uh, probably tomorrow I will be showcasing that new uh, Jade Golem Shaman deck. That's uh, as wild, as for wild as well. Thank you, guys. Bye.